Endpoint Protector is an endpoint security software that lets you monitor all activity in your network regarding portable device use and related data transfers. Today more and more users are getting mobile and make use of portable and lifestyle devices like flash drives or iPods. Endpoint Protector will drastically reduce your risks of data loss, data theft, pod slurping, data leakage and intrusion related threats. The software allows you to effectively enforce your endpoint security policy on all network PCs, notebooks and servers that run Windows XP, Windows Vista or Windows 2003. With this solution you will be able to manage and control the use of flash drives, iPods, portable hard drives and many other endpoint devices that pose a potential threat or data leak to your network. Endpoint Protector gives you the necessary control for regulatory compliance and internal security policy enforcement. Over the next few minutes we will give you an overview of Endpoint Protector and how you will benefit from using it. This video is covering three aspects of the application. General features, working with Endpoint Protector, control and monitor your devices, data and users. Manage portable and endpoint devices such as USB flash drives, iPods, smartphones in order to prevent data loss and data theft. Trace all data transferred to and from portable devices. Keep a copy of all transferred data. Report and analyze of all portable device related data transfers. Enforce encryption of data on portable devices to prevent data loss. Endpoint Protector Server is the only endpoint security solution available that can be deployed on a Windows-based or on a Linux-based server platform. The choice of server platform gives you the flexibility to integrate servers in your existing network infrastructure and reduce your total cost of ownership. Endpoint Protector gives you the possibility to utilize the increased productivity that portable storage and lifestyle devices bring without the exposure to the inherent risks that come along with these devices in an otherwise uncontrolled environment. Locking down USB ports, whether physical or in BIOS, is a drastic solution to a problem that can be solved more elegantly with Endpoint Protector 2008 without compromising productivity or security. Endpoint Protector has an easy to use and intuitive web-based administrative interface. For ease of navigation, you can use your Internet Browser's back and forth buttons to navigate through the Endpoint Protector's administrative and reporting tool interface. After logging into the Endpoint Protector administrative interface, the administrator sees the dashboard. The dashboard offers a number of vital information to the administrator, such as last users active, last active devices, and last file transfers to and from portable devices. Device management. Here the administrator can individually set specific roles for different devices and apply device specific rights like giving full access, no access or read only access to specific devices. Machine Rights Management. Here the administrator can set specific rules for what kind of devices are allowed to be used on a specific PC. If a PC, for example in the financial department of a company, requires the use of DVDs, this specific PC or group of PCs can, for example, be allowed to use internal or external DVD burners. On another group of PCs or one specific PC, users can be given different levels of rights to different kinds of devices. For example, for USB flash drives, the administrator can deny all access to USB flash drives, allow full access to USB flash drives, read only access to USB flash drives, or assign trusted device level requirements. 
More about trusted device levels and trusted devices in general can be seen in another Cosys trusted device video tutorial. Even notebooks that are disconnected from the network stay protected through the application offline capability. All activity on the offline PC or notebook is recorded. Security policies are locally saved and enforced even while the PC or notebook is offline. Upon the next connection to the network or the Internet, all activity and data transfers are reported to the Endpoint Protector server. Now that you have seen an introduction of the administrative features of Endpoint Protector, we will have in the next part of this video tutorial a short look at the powerful reporting and analysis features in Endpoint Protector. One advantage of the administrative and reporting tool is that you have detailed and specific information about each device, user and PC activity within your network available through analysis tools. The detailed device, user and PC activity reports can be for further analysis exported to Excel. The data transfer to and from controlled endpoint devices is closely monitored and recorded for later auditing. In the administrative and reporting part of Endpoint Protector, the administrator can analyze in detail what user has transferred what data to what device. This information gives the administrator a detailed insight in a user's behavior regarding data transfers. This has been just a small selection of the entire set of features available in Endpoint Protector 2008. For more information, please request it directly from us by contacting your COSIS representative, schedule an appointment for an online demonstration, or request a 30-day free trial. To find out more, please visit endpointprotector.com or cosesys.com directly.